Let's make the shower animation without using any fluid simulation in Blender. Here, as you can see, we have quickly modeled the shower scene. Now select the water emitter, go to the particle tab and add a new particle system. Set the number to 80,000, end frame to 100 and lifetime to 5. Next, open the velocity setting and set the object align Z value to minus 50 to make the water fall downward. Go to the render section, set render as to object. Now let's add an aqueous here to use as the water drops. Set subdivision to 1, go to the edit mode, select the top vertex, press O to enable proportional editing, then press ZZ to move it upward along the Z axis and shape it like a water drop. Press Ctrl 3 to add a subdivision modifier. Now select the droplet, scale it down and move it outside the camera view. Back in the particle tab, set the icosphere as the instance object. Adjust the scale and scale randomness value to your liking. Now hit play to see the water falling from the shower. Looks cool already, right? Next add a texture and lighting to your scene and apply a water material to your droplet object for a better realism. Finally, go back to the particle tab, click on cache and hit bake all dynamics. And that's it, you're done. Your shower animation without using any fluid simulation is ready to render. Follow Art of Wave for more.